Hey everybody, this is the fourth year. And in this video, I will be showing you how the Fruity Center plugin works in FL Studio. Now, it's a super simple plugin, but it can be quite useful. And what it's designed to do is to center waveforms in order to remove DC offset. So first I'll give you a quick explanation of what DC offset is. So I have two sounds here. The first one does not have any DC offset, and you can see on this oscilloscope that you know it plays right in the middle, which means its peaks are going above and below zero, which would be minus infinity decibels. And you know that's how waveforms are supposed to work. They're supposed to have positive values and negative values, but sometimes you know, um, due to recording issues or due to distortion or, you know, a number of things, you might get DC offset, which what happens is it pushes the center line, you know, up or down. And you can see this sound has the DC offset. Instead of playing around the center line here, it's playing way up here. And this causes two things. It causes you know, constant noise at zero hertz. And because of that constant noise, it will be eating up your headroom. So you'll see if I play this sound. It's peaking at about you know, minus five to minus six decibels. But if I play the one that does not have the DC offset, it's all the way down at minus 14 decibels. And, you know, headroom is pretty important, especially in electronic dance music. So that's what Fruity Center is designed to do. It's just designed to remove that DC offset. So you'll see now, if I play it, it will bring the waveform back down to the center, and it will bring the peak value lower as well. You'll see it's looking the same as this one is now. So that is the Fruity Center plugin. Thanks for watching my tutorial video. I hope you found it to be helpful. If you want to learn more, be sure to subscribe to my channel so you can watch new videos as soon as I upload them. After that, check out the Beat School website. I'll have the link in the description. All my tutorials are organized on the site so that you can easily find what you need by browsing through the different categories. There are also a ton of awesome resources to help you in every aspect of music production. And if you want to help support me, you can buy any of my sample packs, preset packs, or project files for only $5 or less. This gets you some great sounds for a great price and allows me to spend more time making these tutorials and working on the website. Thanks again for watching my video and have a great day.